January 23rd, transformed by insight, we all with open face, beholding as in a glass the glory of the Lord, are changed into the same image, 2 Corinthians 3.18. The outstanding characteristic of a Christian is this unveiled frankness before God so that the life becomes a mirror for other lives. By being filled with the Spirit, we are transformed, and by beholding, we become mirrors. You always know when a man has been beholding the glory of the Lord. You feel in your inner spirit that he is the mirror of the Lord's own character. Beware of anything which would solely the mirror in you. It is nearly always a good thing, the good thing that is not the best thing. The golden rule for your life and mine is this concentrated keeping of the life open towards God. Let everything else, work, clothes, food, everything on earth, go by the board, saving that one thing. The rush of other things always tends to obscure this concentration on God. We have to maintain ourselves in the place of beholding, keeping the life absolutely spiritual all through. Let other things come and go as they may, let other people criticize as they will, but never allow anything to obscure the life that is hid with Christ in God. Never be hurried out of the relationship of abiding in Him. It is the one thing that is apt to fluctuate, but it ought not to. The severest discipline of a Christian's life is to learn how to keep beholding, as in a glass, the glory of the Lord.